my lovelies. I hope you all are doing great. I'm Joy. Welcome to my kitchen. In today's video, I'm going to walk you through step by step how to prepare these frozen amazing summer treats, popsicles, and so many more. So keep watching and enjoy this video. So let's get started. If you need any of these products, I will put the link at the description box below. In this bowl, I have one ripe mango chopped. I'm going to put them into my mini food processor and blend them all together. Now that I'm through with the blending, I'm going to pour some of the gray into the popsicle mold. I'll put a little bit, then later on I'll add another fruit in between. So at this point I'm pouring some puree, mango puree into the other container, I mean the other popsicle mold. So look at it. So here I have one kiwi. I'm going to peel this kiwi. Now I'm going to cut them into small pieces. I'll proceed by blending them, then I'll add this kiwi puree in between the mango puree. I'm sorry that I couldn't show you when I was pouring the kiwi puree into the popsicle container. It was as a result of my camera. I'm so sorry about that. Next, we are going to prepare banana strawberry popsicles. Here I have one ripe banana. I'm going to peel it and slice it into small sizes. Then transfer it into this my mini food processor. After that, I'll go ahead and blend them to produce that banana puree. Yeah, as you can see, the banana puree is well blended. I will go ahead and pour it into the popsicle mold. As you can see, the previous one was mango and kiwi popsicles. Now we are preparing banana and strawberry popsicles. So for the strawberry here, I have to blend this strawberry with my food processor in order to get the puree. Repeating the same process as usual. I like the vibrant color of the strawberry puree. My dear, can you see that? You know, I like this popsicle mold because it is convenient to use. I like preparing this kind of popsicle during summer period. Not only that it is sugar free, it is healthy, colorful, and refreshing. So for the next one, I'm going to pour in all the previous food puree that I prepared and mix them together. So for this one, I will leave it for you to give it a name. Just tell me, suggest a name for this <laughs> and give me the answer in the comment section below, okay? Wow. 
While watching this video, as you are enjoying what you're seeing, don't forget to hit that subscription button. It is free. Remember to hit the notification bell so that you will not miss any of my videos. God bless you. The next one, we are going to prepare cream circles. Here I have quarter cup of yogurt. Followed by quarter cup of whipping cream. Now I add two tablespoons of honey and mix them thoroughly well. If you watch very well, you will notice that this recipe don't require sugar because all these fruits and fruits that I'm using are very very sweet and healthy. So we don't need additional sugar, but all we need is the natural sugar which is enough for us at this point i'm going to take one orange and squeeze out the juice As you can see, I've already poured in the cream mixture into the popsicle mold. At this point, I'm pouring in the orange juice and mix them a little bit. So the next one we are going to prepare for circle. All I need is to add two tablespoons of cocoa powder to the cream mixture and mix them well. After that, I'm going to pour it into the popsicle container. That is all. Let me use this opportunity to appreciate each and every one of you that are watching my video. For my returning subscribers, you're not taking for granted. I appreciate you all. If you're new here, consider to be part of this family. By subscribing to this channel, subscription, remember, it is free. Click on the notification bell and add the option select all so that you'll be the first to be notified anytime I upload a new video. I appreciate you once again. After watching this video, if you like what you're seeing, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Tell me how you feel at the comment section below. Share my videos with your friends and family and God will bless you. So after filling up the popsicle molds, transfer them to the freezer and leave them to frozen for about 3 hours or more. Then you can be able to enjoy these different frozen summer treats for this season i would like you to give this recipe a try at home it is a very nice healthy dessert you can prepare for your family so three hours later take a look at the results of these different frozen summer treats that we have prepared the popsicles are so colorful, they are so refreshing, and they are healthy. Give it a try. Thank you for watching. Till next time, eat healthy and stay safe. See you in my next video. Bye.